Good morning, everyone, and uh, thanks for joining this new Denial webinar. Today we'll be talking about the new features in Denial Detect 5.0, uh, with a big focus on virtual patching. My name is Stéphane de saint alban and I'm joined today with Vincent Mo by Vincent Maury. Hello. And together we'll be presenting the new features in Detect. Uh, as usual, uh, you will be muted during this call. We are broadcasting from our offices in uh, Paris, and um, you are muted. We do, however, uh, welcome your questions. If you want to type them into the chat room on the right side of your screen, please do so at any time. We'll take uh, some time towards the end of the presentation to answer those questions. All right, so let me... Um, uh, dive into the, the subject of today's webinar. Um, we'll be discussing new features in uh, the uh, version 5 of our Detect family of Varmity scanners. And uh, we'll be discussing uh, for uh, a good third of the content about uh, the uh, new p capabilities provided by this product and in conjunction with our Protect uh, product, our web application firewall products, in terms of uh, patching uh, vulnerable applications. And our intent is to tell you or to show you what can be done today and also what we have in, uh, in the plan for the near term in terms of automating application security beyond just the simple patching of vulnerable applications. Um, <clears throat> just uh, before we get started, uh, you know, a brief reminder, uh, Denial, we're in the business of securing and accelerating applications and have been, uh, been doing so for uh, almost 12 years now. We, we have a, a complete range of web application firewalls called our Protect product line whose role is to filter incoming web traffic and stop layer 7 application layer attacks. We do also have, uh, since the summer of last year, a complete range of vernalty scanners whose goal or whose role is to help you uh, identify vulnerabilities in your in infrastructure uh, and, and by doing so, you know, reducing the attack surface uh, so as to better control the risk of people taking advantage of your web applications to get to your data. And this is our detect product line. And then we also have a, um, a family of products that uh, we call Manage, which is composed today of two products, uh, the Denial Management Console and uh, the Denial Application Security Dashboard, which is a free uh, Splunk-based reporting application. Now, with the uh, with these three products, three product lines, our intent and the rationale before behind our acquiring Vuln IT last year, uh, the the makers of uh, the Detect product line, is really to help practitioners in application security deliver uh, a better. Uh, strategy or better solution for their business, for their organization. So the the intent from the day from the day one was to deliver uh, unprecedented level of integration between web application firewall technology and uh, what Gartner called dynamic application security testing technology, or what we call virality virality scanners. Uh, the idea behind virtual patching was actually cornered uh, several years ago by a number of analysts, including Ed Gartner, to suggest that uh, there's many ways in which uh, these application security products can cooperate to deliver better, uh, more effective protection against modern attacks. And that is really the, the vision behind our acquisition of Vol 19 last year. So if you look at the, the Detect product line, uh, it's composed of three products. Edge Tester is a cloud-based service which people are using to test their infrastructure from the outside, from the internet. 
much like what a hacker would would try to do you know you you know trying to identify uh, assets and uh, vulnerabilities running on these machines or services that's the the first product uh, vulnerability manager is the internal version of the product which uh, is a virtual machine you install in your network and will help you manage vulnerabilities over time uh, you know with the ability to schedule scans to import scans from edge tester and from the auditor product and to take a sort of a, a, a comprehensive look at all your vulnerabilities from within and from outside your network uh, assigning tickets and remediating uh, helping your organization remedy those vulnerabilities to reduce the attack surface Auditor, finally, is the, the sort of a portable version of the product. Uh, it is designed to help organizations who have remote sites uh, or consulting companies, security consultants, who need to be uh, you know, assessing the vulnerability of a, their customers' sites. So it's basically a kind of a mobile version of the product, which uh, runs on a USB stick, bootable USB stick, and is used uh, to get gather data very quickly, very efficiently, and then uh, you know report it, report back to um, to, the, to the the main the main site. All of these products share the same technology, the same engines, uh, based on open source scanners for the most part, but also leveraging some internal developments, especially when it comes to testing web applications, which is going to be at the core of what we're going to be discussing now. So let me, uh, um, before we we go into the sort of the fe new features in uh, Detect 5.0, remind you briefly that the three things, the three key functions of the products is one, to discover your assets. It, it's really used. Uh, you know, the first step in any uh, variety assessment is to identify what's on your network in terms of uh, systems, uh, services, and um, and be able to you know identify your assets. The second step is to identify for each of these assets how their you know what their vulnerabilities are. So, what is the patch level? Uh, are there any trivial passwords uh, associated with those assets that could be used by a hacker? Are there uh, obvious uh, vulnerabilities in the code, uh, especially at the application layer, but also throughout the infrastructure? And finally, the third function is to be able to report and to manage the remediation uh, with the assignation of tickets to various teams in the organization so it has to uh, you know, reduce the attack surface again. So this is the, the, these three functions are performed um, across your infrastructure and looking at network assets, looking at systems, looking at uh, applications, databases, file shares, and even Wi-Fi access points when it comes to the, um, the auditor product. Now, uh, Vincent, why don't you, before you, you get ready to, to work a little bit, uh, let me ask the audience a few questions, if you wouldn't mind.